So Mickelson still needs to do it. The other riders with him. Wuffingham was always sharpish last time, so gate number two has worked well in the latter stages in the qualifying heats. So you've got to believe he's got a chance of getting his nose in front here in heat number 18. Revs are up, tapes are up. Mickelson's nailed it. Got there to the first turn. Here comes Hookenbeck up the inside. Wuffingham very, very wide. Right out in the dirt, here he comes, charging round the outside of Mikko Mickelson. Can he win a race here for the first time this evening? Looking like he's going to hit the front, it's tight. Not quite there. No, it's tight, well, it looks like he's got the bit between his teeth, but Mickelson, this race means a lot to him. He's had a couple of race wins, so even a second might do it for him on eight points, but he'll want to win it. Look at Ty Wuffenden, working the inside beautifully. Superb ride from Ty Wuffenden. Can Mikkel Mickelson respond? It's so far wide, he's still going for it. We're in lap number three, he's round the outside, he's gonna get himself back to the front. Oh, oh there look comes. at that! There comes. Dives to the inside, spectacular speedway here in Melilla. Mikkel Mickelson read that beautifully, and he's down the back straight in heat number 18. And what a night he's had. He finishes on nine, he's in the semi-finals. Fair play. Wolfenden made him work for it. Special speedway there, inside, outside, dramatic stuff again. Mickelson wasn't taking any chances with the second place there, was he? No, he was not. And fair play to him, he showed great commitment. Could have settled for second, but wasn't he was having it. Heat number 18, we have... So, um, uh, Mickelson wins. It again, Mickelson just uh, covering the inside there. Ty Wolfenden right around the outside, bike lurching forward. Front wheel in the air a couple of times, untidy, but uh, got the job done as he generates all that speed around the outside. And uh, Mickelson there, just riding in the middle of the track, gives Ty Wolfen the opportunity to get up the inside of him. I thought it was all over here for Mickelson, but he just rides wider, wider, puts the back wheel in the dirt, and then makes a beautifully decisive move there. Quite late, actually very late, to make that decision to cut back to the inside, ride straight across. Great ride from him. Mickelson going great guns tonight. The winner this year, of course, Mikael Mickelson.